Hello everyone, Tom Davis, Red 4 Reviews, and this is uh, Ghost Games Part 3. So the last over the last week, what I've done to prepare um, for my competition in the Ghost Games, which Ghost Games is going on at Ghost Ring Tactical in San Antonio, New Mexico. So over the last week, I've continued with improving my physical condition, continuing with my, my normal morning routine and um, adding in the workout, and then I also started doing, um, throwing some cardio in there. So we'll press on with that and uh, keep up with that. Also working more of the dry practice in, um, pistol and rifle for that. I went to Tactical Response in Camden, Tennessee, and role played for their force on force training. Um, and as we go into that, I would say if you have not done a force on force, um, that's it's a, solid way to, to show strengths, weaknesses, and uh, to see some scenarios. So to get a force on force class, and in particular, if a place allows you to come back as a role player for it, do that. So uh, also I am signed up for the um, the classes Combat Carbine, Carbine Level 2 with Don Edwards of Greenline Tactical. And you can find those guys online, greenlinetactical.com. Check them out. That class will be hosted uh, at Tactical Response in Camden, Tennessee. Also have signed up for Masad Ayub in August, and that is Armed Citizens Rules of Engagement. That is a non-shooting class, so we'll see. Um, I'm, um, I haven't really looked into it a whole bunch yet, other than I, you know, I recognize Masad Ayub. He does a lot of writing very well um, versed in the community and, and self-defense. So I'm looking at that more as uh, decision-making and what goes into it. So that should apply as I roll into uh, to um, the ghost games. So uh, that being said, yeah, uh, that's kind of the, the week. As I move forward, um, again, uh, this week coming up, not a whole bunch. I've got, uh, I'll just continue on with my uh, physical improvement and then the, the dry practice. And then I'll do a full up um, next week. I think will probably be my uh, my full up video for um, combat carbine level two. And then in addition to that, I'm going to um, tactical response uh, every year. July they put on an alumni weekend, and they host there a lot of classes. Um, the, the, there's not enough. They're good classes, just not enough to build a, a full day or two day curriculum around. And then again, and it's just meeting people, um, other alumni, like-minded folks, and, you know, kind of talk about stuff. Uh, usually a good time, and I expect to, to learn some stuff off of that as well. So um, so there we go. That's uh, the Ghost Games Part 3. And um, I certainly hope you're, you're finding this content uh, helpful. Uh, I'd like to motivate you to get out there and take some training and then to, to practice it at home. Again, as our uh, founders had originally intended, is for us to be trained and proficient in the use of the firearms. And that's that's what we have to do. That's the well-regulated part of uh, the Second Amendment. So, And that's us being trained and proficient to stand up against tyranny, which is uh, extremely important today, uh, unless you're hiding under a rock. So... Uh, like I said I got a couple another uh, another video I'll be doing uh, coming up. So there we go. Tom Davis, Red Four Reviews, and it is your duty to be well regulated.